Good afternoon. My name is Robert Monty, and welcome to my continuing series on international tax issues. Well, today is a great day for a couple of reasons. First of all, look, I know what the day is, and we have less than a month to go before this continuing busy season comes to an end. Moreover, I think it's a great day because I was actually able to tie my tie today. You all know that I broke my elbow ice skating a couple of months ago. In the past few past few months, when I've had to have a tied time, I had my wife do it. And she has enjoyed cutting off the circulation of my neck. I greatly appreciate it. But somehow I think she was trying to tell me that I was asking too much of her. So that being said, today I want to talk about a structuring issue. And that structuring issue is whether a foreign parent should have a U.S. holding company for its group. Now, over the long haul, this is a great structure to have a holding company because you have consolidation. Over the long haul, profits of one entity will offset the losses of another. So it's a good long-term structure. The downside is that suppose that they want to get rid of one of the U.S. subs, U.S. Hold Co. will sell it and have U.S. tax on it. And then there's going to be withholding tax on the repatriation of those sales proceeds to Forco. What about not using a U.S. holding company? Well, assuming that none of these subsidiaries are U.S. real property holding corporations, Forco's sale of any of the shares of these subs will not result in any United States tax. The downside is that there isn't going to be any consolidation of offsetting profits and losses of the various subsidiaries. So this is a good short-term structure. So if you're in it for the long haul, you want to have a holding company. If you want to flip the shares of these companies, you want to have it be uh, without a holding company. So that's all I have for today. Thank you for joining me. I look forward to talking to you the next time when we further discuss international tax issues. Remember, tax is fun.